Welcome to Tokyo Saurus. So what's up in Japan? Nier Automata is about to come out in just two more days, and a week prior to release, they released a new trailer into the public's eye on Japan television. After watching it, people were already a little creeped out by the TV trailer. With all the crushed, real dolls, and for a trailer about a video game, it had pretty much only a few seconds of the gameplay in the entire trailer. But it turns out, the trailer that was aired on live television was already censored by Square Enix prior to getting approved for live television. And the uncensored slash real version of the trailer was released on the official Square Enix YouTube channel three days later. And after watching the uncensored version, you can immediately tell why Square Enix's QC team decided to censor it before sending it out. For those of you who didn't watch it yet, I have both of them linked in the description below, so do check it out. But the main difference between the two trailers is that the censored version looked like the aftermath of what happened in the uncensored version. The one that was broadcasted on live television had broken up dolls, while the uncensored version showed you just exactly how that happened. It included saws cutting the heads of dolls, big machinery flattening them, industrial tools sawing through their bodies, if you thought the first trailer was disturbing after watching this one, you would seriously reconsider the meaning of the word. The narrator says, we were born to be destroyed. Even though we're not alive, we kill each other. Which is probably referencing the main character and how she's probably very similar to those dolls that we just saw get wrecked. Nier Automata is set in a world after the original Nier game, but it is not specified exactly when. The story revolves around a war between the remnants of humanity and the machine army of invaders from another world. Humans make combat androids called Yorha to fight these invaders, and that's how the story begins. The main character is also a Yorha, which is why she feels the way she does in the narration of the trailer. I have never checked the original Nier series for myself, but this one does look very interesting. But what's even more interesting is how Nier always manages to catch the internet's eye and goes viral from stunts like the one that happened just last month, with fans uploading ton of fan art of the main character's butt onto the internet. That got so many people talking, even the director of the series, Taro Yoko, tweeted jokingly, telling people to make a zip file of everything that was uploaded onto the internet so far of the butt, and send it to him in a neat package, so he doesn't have to find it himself. But what do you think of Nier Automata? Are you gonna play it when it comes out in just two days, or are you not interested? As usual, let me know in the comments below. Thumbs up the video if you liked it, and follow Tokyo Source on social media for Japanese culture tweets and video updates. And make sure you're subscribed so you can get the latest things people are talking about in Japan right in your inbox. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.